Today we are working on one of our process fan. This fan has a high vibration in 1x range and this fan needs uh, balancing. So this is located in our primary uh, burner which is over here and the vibration is going about 5.5 or 6 millimeter. So here you can see the door we removed as this door was not there. So we fabricated this door. A new door we have just fabricated for the service purpose and here inside you can see the, the impeller and these studs as we mount it for the door and this guy you can see he is just cutting the holes and he is he just fabricated so here you can see this is our vein one vein which we mark as a zero and this zero I just put this vein in the horizontal plane this is what is our horizontal plane with the impeller shaft you can see and along with this if I will come here here you can see this shaft is there exposed here so what I will do I will have to put the my reflection tape over here this is a reflection tape actually on the shaft so that it will reflect the position or the phase of the shaft to the tachometer which is our requirement for the balancing machine so I'm going to fix the tape on the shaft and this is on the location uh, which I just show you inside the impeller and it is corresponding to our zero vein and then we are going to just fix it firmly so that it should not come off during running and now uh, we are going to fix our uh, tachometer or the phase reference sensor you can see in front of the same shaft and uh, this will take the reference phase from this shaft and the magnet I just switch it on so that it will be firm in position here now just I am connecting its cable to the main unit that is the SKF GX uh, to the power terminal we can connect it to the channel 2 also but I am connecting to the power as you can see I just fix it there firmly and now we are switching on the machine and here we are going to the balancing menu here is the balancing and we hit the enter button this is the hit the enter button which we already hit so the balancing is just started initiated and here it is asking for the old job is there in the machine so we will not and then what we are going to do is we are just fixing the sensor and uh, we will collect the vibration on the all four points horizontal and verticals uh, DE and NDE and where the vibration will be high we will select that point so here we just uh, select the job and then we will run the machine and then we'll look for the vibration uh, the door is going to be fixed this is a new door actually it's giving a little bit trouble in fixation also and this is important to fix the door because if it will not be fixed properly the all the sides here will f flow and will the wind will create a big problem for us and also it is dangerous so we are fixing the door firmly even two bolts two nuts will be enough but as the guy is going to fix all the nuts you can see and he has no intention to come on camera even so here he is going to uh, tight them using some spanner some ratchet of course he is going to use to firmly tight and now I'm going to start the fan this is from the local of course and I will go to the local I'm giving taking confirmation from them okay they confirmed to start so I'm going to go to local and then local start so the fan had been started you can see the motor is running now and uh, what we will take from their information is the vibration and the phase So right now as you can see the information 
the, uh, the instrument is just collecting the information it will take a while to collect it as you can see we just put on drive and side horizontal and uh, it is asking for the balancing yes we are going to balance so we hit the yes and it is ok now it is taking data so here it is showing somewhat 5.2 millimeter per second 5.2 millimeter per second and of course at uh, phase 61 degrees so we will change the sensor position to the vertical and then we will collect for the reading now we are changing to vertical we will look for the maximum vibration on that point we will balance this machine so here you can see we are getting not much something 4.3 now this is not the proper way to take the axial so to the non drive end side free side horizontal we are going to measure the vibration this is also not big as the machine is still collecting data sometimes it is stuck in the process so then we are going by some other way we are reading this by some way so this is 2.4 millimeter per second is coming this is also not big reading you can see and now we are going for the same free end side vertical this is again small reading is not big 0 0.5 or 0 0.7 millimeter per second is enough small and now it is reaching to 1.7 something like that but it is still small as compared to 5 or 4 here on this point so we will change our sensor to this point we will proceed balancing with the drive end side horizontal which is over here with this bearing we will proceed our balancing and this is now coming something 4.5 millimeter per second at angle same 60 61 something like that so the good way is now we are proceeding further and hit enter now we are going to stop the machine so I just off and stop the machine so it's a time to fix the trial weight as we got the reference run and we are going to prepare a weight over here so something 6 15 16 to 20 gram will be okay uh, here as you can see we are preparing another weight and another weight which is the final weight is 16 some 16.5 gram or 16 gram I am just going to fix on 0 degrees so same 0 degrees we selected better if we select 180 but we are selecting 0 as my assistance assistant is saying that we have to select 0 so 16.5 gram at 0 degrees and 459 millimeter per second is the radius for this particular impeller this data I just entered and no estimation for the weight so this data we fixed in the machine we put it in and now I am going to start the machine once again with this trial weight fixed so the machine had been started you can see actually what we are going to do in this process is we are going to make a change so the same place the sensor will be uh, both sensors will be and we are going to look for the change there should be a 30 percent change in vibration or there should be a 30 percent change in phase so whichever we are going to proceed it with enter whatever change we will get we will be able to proceed further and calculation will come so now i am going to show you the vibration had been increased 8.4 before it was for something 4.2 so it's more than 30% uh, change it's about 100% change so it's okay phase is nearly the same so we are going to enter it and it is telling that we have to leave the trial weight I am saying no we will remove this weight and we'll fix another weight which will be uh, calculated 17.8 at degrees 173 degrees 
173 degrees angle on the impeller we will fix a weight that will be something 17 gram so we are staying we are waiting for the machine to stop now the machine is stopped and we are just going to uh, count the veins that will be something 5.7 veins we will get the degrees 173 this is coming this is 5.5 and here is something 5.7 this this location so we are going to mark this location 5.7 and just we will fix a weight on this location and that weight exactly not exactly but about uh, 17 gram so we will weld it on both sides this same weight on this particular location so here you can see the welder is going to weld the same weight on the same degrees which we already marked for him and this is of course on the opposite the direction of rotation and it is already welded you can see now he is going to remove his uh, tool that is something a grip plier for the gripping of weight so we will fix the door back <coughs> the door has been fixed he will secure it with the nuts this time he just put two nuts it's okay so these guys are just making calculations he is uh, one guy my assistant is uh, showing calculations to the other mother of my assistant he is from Taliban actually so <laughs> now we are going to prepare again okay so we are going to start I'm taking confirmation from them it's okay now we are able to start we are going to start it the machine had been started you can see the motor and now uh, the vibration is dramatically reduced and uh, this is a substantial action we take and uh, you can see 1.5 millimeter per second voila very nice and degree 153 so we have a successful balancing on this point thank you for watching keep on watching i will bring more and more videos share with your friends